Hello beautiful people, it is Chantelle here from Clogasmic and today we are going to be doing a rainbow French manicure. I'm not going to lie, a traditional French manicure is just not my thing. So today we're going to spice it up and do some rainbow tips with a black base. So I'm starting off here, my nails have been prepped, they've got their base coat on and I'm going in with my first coat of black gel, keeping the layers nice and thin so that it doesn't wrinkle at all. And I'm going to seal the edge there and I'm going to cure this coat for two minutes. I'm using Licorice by Biosculpture Gel. I love this colour, it's super pigmented, really really good. So I'm going to do all five fingers with my first coat, set that and then I'm going to do my second coat. So now my first coat is cured and set and I'm going to go in and do a second coat so we get the depth that we like and I can make sure that that black is right close to the cuticle how I like it to be. That is the one thing with doing a dark base, your application has to be perfect. Make sure you've gone right to the back where you need it to go so you create that really nice neat cuticle area. I love how glossy this black is as well, look at it, this hasn't even got a top coat on, absolutely love it. So I'm going to go in and do my second coat and cure that again for two minutes. So for my rainbow colours, I'm using Wildfire, Butterfly Queen, Honey Darling, Hotski to Trotsky, and Video Violet by CND. And this is what I'm going to create the rainbow tips with. So this next step is the vital step, you cannot miss this step. I'm going to wipe over my cured second layer of the black gel and lightly buff with a white block. Do not buff too much because you don't want to buff the colour off, but you want to buff the tacky layer off and make sure that your nails are shaped exactly how you want them. So as you can see, I'm just wiping with the alcohol product there just to remove the tacky layer, lightly buffing over with the white block and then making sure that the shape of my nail is exactly how I want it. The reason you're doing this is because because when we add the rainbow tips and the glitter, if you do not buff the black bit, the glitter will also stick to the black bit, which is not what we want. We want the glitter to just stick to the rainbow tips. So this part of the tutorial is vital. You must do this, otherwise it will look amazing, but you're just gonna get glitter everywhere, which is not what we want today. So make sure you do this step before you add your tips. So this is where the fun begins. We are now doing the rainbow tips. So my nails are prepped, buffed over. I'm just making sure there's no fluff or anything on there. And I'm going to draw on my French manicure tip, just like you do with a regular French manicure, making sure that that smile line is absolutely perfect and how you want it. So I'm going in there with a very thin coat again of the purple. You don't have to do two coats of your color. You're just doing one as a base to stick that glitter to. 
So I'm going to do my purple there, make sure I seal the end. And then I'm going to go through and do the same thing with all the colours. If at any point you do not like how your smile line is, you can go back in with your gel brush and just neaten it up just like this. Remember that your French detail will not be finished until you put it in that lamp, so you can play around with it as much as you want. You just want to make sure you've got one coat of all five colours on those tips. This look would look really cool with a white base as well, actually, now I'm looking at it looking at it back over again um, but yeah we're doing it with a black one today I'm just going to do my pink and my red and then I'm going to cure those again for two minutes And of course you need glitter. So I've got five glitters here. The red one is from Lacente. The pink is one that I've had for ages. The gold is Lacente. And the blue is another one I've had for ages. And the purple is Lacente. <laughs> so I'm going to go in with the purple holographic from Lacente. And I'm going to do that little finger. So you just take a little bit of glitter and brush it on. And as you can see where we've buffed that black over, the glitter doesn't stick. It's just going to stick to the tacky layer that we've just cured. Ta-da! Literally amazing moment you can create so many good nail art looks by using this technique if you buff over your base color first whatever design you draw on with whatever product you draw on after the glitter will just stick to that section so that is how you create a look like this with just having glitter on the tip without it being crazy fiddly and really really hard work if you have any glitter that doesn't stick where you want it to so it overlaps a tiny bit I like to use my cuticle pusher here just like this just to gently ease the glitter to the area that I want it to and then that is it so I'm going to go through and do that on all five fingers with all five glitters Thank you. 
And there we have it. We've done all five glitters there. And this look is so cool. So nice for summer and festivals and holidays and things like that. So now all you need to do is apply your top coat. So I'm just going to go in now with my top coat gel. Make sure I seal the end. Make sure I've really covered that bit where the glitter is on the end. Because if you don't, when you wipe over at the end with your alcohol product, you will remove the glitter, which is obviously not what you want. So I'm going to put my top coat on, make sure I've sealed the end, set that for two minutes. And that is your look done. I hope you've liked this video. If you have, please do not forget to like, comment and subscribe. And if you are a nail tech looking to get new clientele into your business, I will leave a link down below for our free client getting report that will hopefully help you out. I really hope you've enjoyed this video, guys. And if you try this, please tag me. I would love to see your designs on Instagram. It makes me so happy when I see you guys recreating our looks. Have a great day. Bye.